Now, President Donald Trump's travel ban on people from seven predominantly Muslim countries has suffered a new setback. This time, a Virginia judge ruling that it's likely uh, violates the rights of state residents. Let's get more and uh, get over to Ramey Innocencia in New York for that. Ramey. Yeah, not just the state's residents, not just Virginia's residents, but also its institutions is what this judge is saying. And this potentially moves it closer, one step closer to the Supreme Court. Now, a little bit more about this judge. Uh, her name is uh, Leonie Brinkema, and this is out of the uh, U.S. Eastern District uh, in Alexandria, Virginia. She was appointed by President Bill Clinton almost a quarter of a century ago, a democratically nominated judge here. 1993 was when she started her commission, and she was actually fundamental in the initial pushback that we saw uh, back on January 28th uh, with the initial immigrant ban that President Trump did put out. She issued a temporary restraining order, a TRO, uh, that gave all permanent legal residents uh, access to lawyers. There are about 60 of them over at the airport there, Dulles International Airport. She also blocked petitioners from being removed and does count herself as one of four judges across the country who did push back after that immigrant ban was first uh, rolled out. But the question now, Rich, is whether this will actually matter or not. A lot of people right now in the initial reaction are saying that it probably won't. One, because uh, uh, Mr. Trump said that he might issue a totally new immigration order uh, to revise the ban and also that uh, pending appeals, it could go to uh, the Supreme Court, Rich.